Hey, welcome to Graphic Policy Television, GPTV. I'm Brian My Hands. This is A Business Proposal, Volume 1. Original stories by Hewa, art by Narak, adapted by Perilla, translation, Tapas Entertainment, and lettering, Abigail Blackman. All right, so this is published by Izzy Press, so I guess it's manhwa? It's not manga, but I guess it would be manhwa. Well, whatever. Not the biggest of deals. Um, so the story is uh, about this girl named Hari Shin, who is just kind of like your average worker. She works with this corporation. She has a new CEO uh, that is showing up uh, and works for a company where everyone is like freaking out about the CEO. Her friend is um, uh, named Young CEO, who is an heiress, like super rich, and keeps on getting thrown on blind dates um, that her father's trying to set her up with. And she doesn't want to do it anymore. So she gets Hari to take her place for the latest blind date. The blind date turns out to be the new CEO. Uh, Hari it takes a little while for Hari to realize that. Uh, she attempts to destroy the date, uh, except the new CEO has a um, has decided that whoever he meets, no matter who she is, he's going to marry her. Uh, so it's a lot. It's a uh, um, you know story of mixed mixed people, you know, uh, of, of, of fake identities, and um, it's interesting. It's cute. It's, it's actually really cute. I, I think it's really interesting is there seems to be a string of manga, manhwa that I've been reading lately that's all about, like, the ad, this average worker who winds up, like, dating the CEO or something like that of, her, of their corporation. It's never some, like, fellow that works in the stock room. It's always the CEO. Uh, it's clearly, there's, like, a genre and a thing out there. Um, the other thing that always kind of strikes me is there's no way these things would be, like, past muster legally in the U.S. Like, they all scream sexual harassment and um, some major issues within the company. Uh, especially a few of them where the CEOs wind up being kind of obsessive weirdos. Um, so there's that thing as well. And, um, but, you know, just forgetting how realistic these things are, it's, it's a rom-com. Like, it's a cute rom-com that you just kind of throw away any logic and you just roll with it. Uh, you know, the, the things that Hari does to attempt to basically, like, throw off and, and ruin these, uh, ruin the date and get this guy to leave her alone is actually pretty entertaining. Um... You know the where it ha where it goes to her friend. I think is pretty entertaining. You know all of it's really kind of predictable in a in like a very kind of like paint by number sort of way, but it still works and it's still cute and it, yeah. I mean it's, there's something entertaining about it. Like I I don't know. I'm like I'm a sucker for rom coms. I do like the the genre generally. Uh, you know there's there's something nice about it and I think where this eventually goes, especially where I, I especially towards the end at the you know, very end. Um, it does go a place where I wasn't quite expecting it, but then again, like, once it kind of comes out and you're like, oh, of course it's going to go there, um, makes complete sense, and yeah, it winds up checking on another box of, like, paint-by-number rom-com. Uh, but again, it works. It's entertaining. The characters are cute. The situations are cute, and that's really all it's supposed to be is where you're sitting there going, ah, uh, and this does that pretty well. Uh, I like the art. The art is really solid. Um... You know how the how the story is like plays out. I think is pretty good. There's there's some entertaining of like you kind of wondering how I got here. Like it opens up with the CEO calling um, calling Hari and being like, "Will you marry me? Like I want you to marry me, marry me." And she's just like, "No, no, 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 no." Uh, so then it kind of goes in the back and be like, "You know, you might have wondered how I got here," sort of thing, which is entertaining. Um, that's kind of the entertaining the whole chapter. Uh, so it's broken out into a lot of chapters. I don't even know how many chapters it is towards the end. Um, but it's it's good. Like, it works works well. It's entertaining. There's 14 chapters, apparently. Um, it's cute. The the characters are cute. Like, it's just, it's your typical rom-com is what it comes down to. It. Uh, so I, I recommend it. If, like, if you like that genre, it, it works. You know, I think it's a little weird. There's a whole bunch of, like, average worker gets asked out by her, their CEO genre, comics, manga, manga out. But, like, whatever. Uh, as long as it's entertaining uh, and doesn't get too creepy, this isn't this isn't the creepy department. Thankfully, it's it's still relatively cute. Uh, you can go get it out now. It's on comic shops. We're gonna link beneath this video. Open your zip code or tell the comic shops near you. No shot, no problem. We do have some links where you can purchase your own. There'll be affiliate links, so we get a small percentage by doing that. You'll support our site. So thank you. 
And uh, just uh, I also want to thank Izzy Press. Yeah, Press for us up this review copy. Thank you for that. And, of course, you all watching, thank you as well. If you're into manga, manhwa, graphic novels, comics, check us out every single day at graphicpolicy.com. We're on Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, Tumblr, Instagram, TikTok, Mastodon. All at Graphic Policy, keeping it nice and consistent. Until next time, keep reading those comics and keep it geeky. Hey, thanks for watching the previous video from Graphic Policy Television. Just by watching, you help support our site. Thank you so much. Now, if you're watching these videos, you probably care about geeky things like movies, television, comic books, toys, games, video games, you name it. You can go and subscribe right now to our YouTube channel to stay in touch and catch all the new videos, or check out our website at graphicpolicy.com. There's a nice link on this end of the video. But as always, thank you for watching. Keep on rocking and keep it geeky.